Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all appropriate ages, good morning, or good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are. I haven't done a Warframe video in a while, and I haven't done a video since, what, Thursday, Friday last week? Because my body, despite being back in the hospital, I've come back and my body's just been in a physical funk, and I'm dying internally. But that being said, let's crack on. Still on PS4, we haven't got Fortuna yet, but I was watching Pat from Super Best Friends play. I was watching his recent stare at Warframe where he uh, did some spy missions for Natane Extract, but he was using Loki. And there's nothing wrong with Loki, but the best frame for spy missions pardon me, is Ivara, which you actually obtain through spy missions, <laughs> ironically. So this is a little bit of a video for Pat, and he was using a lot of ciphers, which is understandable for corpus spy missions, but one of the reasons Ivara is the best for spy missions, invisibility is actually based on energy drain, not a timer, like Loki. And this particular mod, Infiltrate. So you can bypass all laser barriers of all kinds, and you gain movement speed while invisible, which is perfect. Now this is a zero form of frame. I've also got energy siphon on, speed drift, and I've just gone for duration Hang on, is that ability range? Uh, I guess it's because I ran out of other mods. Plus 80% energy spent on abilities is converted to shields, so there we go. Fleeting expertise, streamlined flow, narrow-minded. So we've got 175 duration, 175 efficiency. But infiltrate is the mod you need. And you can get that from the parent sequence. So, for Pat, let's go to Pluto, and I think this is the hardest Corpus spy mission there is. <coughs> <coughs> Fucking hell, I am dying. <coughs> and with that being said, uh, I will cut here and you'll see me on Pluto. Uh, so here we are on Oceanum. Got my trusty Avaro with the Infiltrate mod. I'm also, for my operator, using the Xeneric Focus. So, got Energizing Dash, and I will soon be at max energy, 525. Come and hit it. 524, there we go, 525. Now let's just prowl. You can still roll, you can still Let's just steal a bit, take you out. You don't really need to go invisible all the time, but I prefer to. trigger alarms of any kind because I have infiltrate and as you can see spy missions are a breeze the only thing you got to worry about is this now I do have ciphers but in case you don't have ciphers this is where I completely mess it up oh no maybe not just go around the outside, just get the outline done first. Oh god damn it, keep over shooting. There we go. Just get the outline done first and there you go. 
Have that. How did it go through you? I was standing right behind you. And plus, stealing from people while invisible. Uh, you do have the chance to get energy back with energy orbs. Ivara is definitely one of the best solo frames you could have. So if you don't have her yet, just keep using Loki and uh, go spy missions solo just to get all the flawless extractions. <clears throat> Right, is it this one? Nope, it's the other one. There we go. And drop down here. And there. See how easy it is? You know, practice makes perfect. The amount of times that I've failed these in the past. Or had to rely on ciphers like a motherfucker, but... There we go. Oh, do you have? Nope. And we're coming up to the last one. There's a soma cord in there. <coughs> Just walk along the lasers. Thank you, infiltrate. I love you. How easy this is. Do I have this one? Yep, I do. And there we go. Flawless extractions all around. We have everything we came for. Extraction. Ah. Still a terrible shot. Infiltrate does not improve your aim. You have to do that all by yourself. Are you kidding me? Die. There we go. Oh, 89,000. And got my. <laughs> got my find one mod. And we're all clear. And I got 3,000 standing for my Arbiter Hexus, 1,500 for my Cephalon Suda. And what I get? T1 Relic and 6,000 credits. Not bad. Not bad at all, if I do say so myself. What's a T1 Relic? <coughs> and that only took eight minutes.
All right, let's have a look at the T1 relic, shall we? What is that again? Come on, load up, you wafty piece of shit. Why are you not loading? What is going... Thank you. Fucking Jesus. I've got ten of them, so Tibber and Prime Barrel... Yeah, it's not bad. This is what I want to start going for next. Got two A5 Re Radiant Relics. A lot of Vasto gear. <coughs> but yeah. Pat, if you ever see this, that was just me showing you a much more efficient way, which you probably already knew, but I don't know if you did, so I thought, why not lend a helping hand? Also, this would be good for people on uh, Nintendo Switch, since it just came, Warframe just came out on a Switch. Uh, do spy missions uh, to unlock component blueprints for Ivara, unlock her, do parent sequence, get the infiltrate mod. Uh, follow that little tip for how to do uh, the corpus hacks, and you should be fine. Hello, Sheila. How's it going? Come on. Come over here. There you go. Right. And with that being said... Oh, yeah. I got a bit greedy and I brought two pedestal primes. <laughs> Why not? And my Obsidian Ivara is on top of there, as she belongs. And with that being said, uh, Pat, hope that helps. Nintendo, I hope that helps. Anyone that was having trouble getting Ivara or doing Corpus Spy Hacks, I hope that helps. And I shall see you all later.